dawn's early light What so proudly we hailed At the twilight's last gleaming Whose broad stripes and bright stars Through the perilous fight O'er the ramparts we watched Were so gallantly streaming And the rocket red glare The bombs bursting in air Gave proof through the night That our flag was still there Oh, say does that star-spangled banner yet Or the land of the free and the home of the brave. Welcome to another edition of the Make a Difference Minute from the Mark White Show, where we're sharing stories to encourage and inspire. Located in Tuscumbia, Alabama, the Alabama Music Hall of Fame honors Alabama's music achievers. Open Tuesday through Saturday, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Give them a call at 256-381-4417. Check them out on the web at alamhof.org. This is the Make a Difference Minute from the Mark White Show. I have with me Dr. Cher Rouse, who's with Limestone County Superintendent of Schools, along with my friend Todd Tomerlin. And Stacy Givens was with us. She was showing a sensory room here at the school, which is for children who have sensory issues, and also have Ricky Wise, Assistant Principal at East Limestone Middle School. Even as adults, as we come into the room, it's very comforting. Um, the lighting helps, the colors help. And then, of course, they have all type of devices in the room um, to help students just just calm down and relax a little bit when they may be upset about something and they need to get back into the classroom. You know, our goal, of course, is to provide the best education we possibly can and um, to have this room like this and to, and to have a community group um, like Makeaway Foundation that's willing to come into our schools and provide this space. It just says a lot about our community, our caring community that really puts our kids first and we can't say enough about that. At East Limestone High School we have a, an autism unit here. In that unit along with when a, a child has autism one of the things that they struggle with a lot of times are sensory issues. You know they become overstimulated, they need additional time to complete tasks. Um, there are times when we have to try to work with them to replace certain behaviors um, and not only our children with autism but also our children that have social emotional disabilities. Our sensory room is benefiting them as well. Our teachers love it because what takes place in here leads to a more productive academic environment when they return to the classroom. It's going to help many kids, typical special needs. It's going to help the teachers, administrators across the board. So, Todd Tomerlin, he's on the board of directors, Makeaway Foundation. If you have a suggestion for the Make a Difference Minute, send it to themarkwhiteshow at gmail.com. This is Mark White encouraging you to find your purpose by making a difference in someone's life today.